any anime you might start this year? Let's take a look. Because I actually am curious as to what the fuck is even coming out. Oh! I know what's coming out. Promise Neverland. Freaking My Hero. And, uh... I know there's something... I think there's something More else. Jujutsu Kaisen. Well, it's I need to catch up on that. And I need to catch up on Attack on Titan, even though I read the manga anyway, so... It is lit. I know. I'm the one that told you guys about it. And freaking Brandon was only... Though he was only he only na just now finally decided to watch it with you guys. When I I literally told him about it months ago when it first started coming, I was like, "Yo, you're probably gonna like this." Are you gonna watch Chainsaw Man when it comes out? Yeah. Oh, when is this coming? <gasps> ah! Doctor Stone is coming back in 12 days. Oh yeah, it is. Yeah, rewatch it all over again. Uh, all right, here I I'll show you guys my screen so you guys can see it in the sh in the stream. It is. Manga my Hero real. Season Five. Wait, oh, Re Zero's having another oh. season? Bruh, I don't even care anymore. I honestly, yeah. I lost interest in ReZero, to be honest. I gave up in the show. Like, it, it got, like, I watched the first five or six episodes of season two, and it was so, it was such a drag to watch. It was mad boring that I literally was just like, all right, I'm done. I'm over this. Peep the cover. Oh, my God. You guys have no idea what you guys are getting in for. If you don't read the, the Promised Neverland manga, y'all don't realize how good this shit is about to be. I finished I the whole thing. Okay. Yeah, it looks like Beastars is coming back, too, in four days. Yeah, I'm good on that. <laughs> I watched the first season. It wasn't terrible. I did too. Even Galleon 3.0 plus 1.0 thrice upon a time. I should probably... This is a movie. I should probably just watch the original Even Galleon. <laughs> it's gonna be a while. Oh, they're having another Kobayashi Dragon Maid? I literally... I started... The, the, the time I... I mean, I can't even say I really started watching it because I was... Wa I, I watched random episodes that they aired on Twitch that one time. Damn, we're, we're about to be loaded up on anime, huh? People really think they're gonna be called a furry for watching i mean it's not really true because like i saw the whole first season and i am by no means a furry like at all seven deadly sins i never started that also starts in four days this doesn't have a date the kobayashi san chino meido dragon s <laughs> that's what it's called a oh, lot yeah log horizon is coming back too i never saw it brandon Very saw it he, i don't know if he finished it but he definitely watched some of it sword art mo <gasps> movie by a1 oh the skate one in one week by bones skate the infinity that comes out literally in one week that shit is gonna be fire what website am i on i'm on anylist.co if you want to go ahead and follow me on here so you can see what i've read watched, in progress dropped any of that shit you could here I'll actually matter of fact i'll i should actually have a command for that i keep hearing good things about that time i got reincarnated as a slime they're about to have part two or season two, part two. So I'm a spider, so what? What the fuck is this? That's another Bruh. isekai. Oh, of course it's an I isekai. Yo, isekai is Lil Uch's favorite genre of anime. No, no. <laughs> I told Bree what you said. You were like, all isekai is trash. <laughs> that was basically just harems and like mystical worlds. Exactly. That's what I said. <laughs> that is what I said. Yo, you hear how mad Holy. this kid gets? Yo, Fruits Basket Season 3. I used to have a friend in middle school. I used to fucking make fun of her all the time because I used to be really judgmental anime person back in the day. Because if you weren't watching Shonen... I, well then you were wasting your time <laughs> that was how yeah, i used to be right. yo they're having another volleyball anime that's not haiku how dare they how they're dare they <laughs> the only other one I, uh, besides haiku is that one i forget what it was called i started it and never finished it it was like it was like a doubles volleyball anime i literally forget what it was oh i think it was called harukana receive but i never finished that either Yo, sh I forgot Shaman King's coming back. Holy fuck! Where they don't have a they don't have a date for that shit though. Shaman King is a cla is one of the classic mangas. Not it's not that classic, but it's classic for me. It's like I don't know if Shaman King came out in the late '90s or the early 2000s, but it's definitely early 2000s. Yo, Bree, I think your 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 guy Uzumaki is getting an anime. Guys, this is not this is not Naruto, by the way. This is a horror genre. Should I should I even check out this fucking wannabe haiku? <laughs> You know, I can't deal with you. I don't mean to sound disrespectful, but that's the only one that I've really known about. Because I'm not going to lie, as far as the the sport genre comes down to, like, basketball ones, I know others outside of Kuriko. Haikyuu is legitimately the only... As, well, Haikyuu and the one that I mentioned before is the only one that I actually know about. Shaman King started in Jump in 98, but then it moved to another magazine. It's also the reason why we never see Yo or any Shaman King characters in the Jump games. 
Yo, I never realized that. Wait, are you sure he wasn't in <coughs> Jump <coughs> Ultimate Stars? I know he wasn't in no fucking Jump Force. <laughs> that much I know. All jokes aside, all troll aside, I know that the most popular basketball one is most likely Slam Dunk. I can't wait for fucking Dr. Stone. The Doc. The, the doc. doc. Is this a continuation of Dragon Maid? Or is this like a, re a redone... The second season. Okay, it is the second season. So I got I can't even plan to watch it because I need to watch the first one still. Yo, the way of the house husband? What the fuck is this? That looks like it could be funny. It's a comedy slice of life. Oh, new SSS grid, man. I forgot about this. Wait, what? Yes. It's called Di uh... Dina Zanon. Hell yeah. Oh, Gintama. Bro, I need to fucking get back into that. You know, the one time I tried to watch Gintama with these fools, they all didn't have no interest in it because the, the first episode was not yeah the first they didn't Wait, like how the first these? episode what was do you mean these? What do you mean these? when i say these i mean you brother not Uj, me. and no, dad not me. not me i never walked in Tom. okay then you must have been too young to remember then yo record of ragnarok i need a street date for this what is this tokyo revengers oh it's a romance uh. oh summer 2021 is when the new the new my hero academia movie comes out okay well, that's in Japan. That's that that them is not coming out for us. Of of stuff that's most popular, it won't be in case considered great because it's made to appeal to a more broad audience. Therefore, it won't hit the individual niches of each person. Yes, DBZ, Haiku, Naruto, and other shonen are generic, but it's their generic nature that makes them popular. I mean, you don't have to explain this shit to me. I already know. Like, you want to talk about generic? You, you need to talk to every single person that's sucking demon slayers you know what okay because <laughs> that shit is good but everyone's it making not. it way yeah. too overhyped you ha you don't gotta tell me because i understand like i love my shonen but i know like if if something else better comes out like vinland saga then i will acknowledge that shit i'm not gonna lie that was anime of 2019 free Yo, Platinum End is getting an anime? I'm gonna check this out. Platinum Fine, End is done by the same dudes that did Death Note. Yo, there's a World Ends With You animation. I, that means I need to actually play the RPG on my Switch. I never played it. What is that thing called Eden? Eden? So I, I put this on my um, plan to watch because it looked interesting. Uh, it, 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 here, I'll read you the synopsis. Thousands of years in the future, a city known as Eden 3 is inhabited solely by robots whose former masters vanished a long time ago. On a routine assignment, two farming robots accidentally awaken a human baby girl from stasis, questioning all they were taught to believe, that humans were nothing more than a forbidden ancient myth. Together, the two robots secretly raise the child in a safe haven outside Eden. And it's supposed to be on Netflix, and it's supposed to come out May 2021. It's only supposed to be four episodes, so... Yeah, I said, I figured, why not? It sounds decent. Oh, Eureka 7. I need to get into that shit. I have the Blu-ray and I never watched it. Or no, wait. <laughs> is it? A no, I don't know if it's Eureka that I got. Oh, yeah. I was about to watch and then Brie fucking stopped my whole tracks and she was like, nah. If you're going to watch anything like this, you need to watch Gurren Lagann. There it is. I wasn't mad. Gurren Lagann was like, oh, Baki, son of ogre, fuck. Ah, ah, when does this happen? Oh, no date. Oh, no date. That is my most anticipated anime right there for this year. Baki, son, adding it to the favorites already. And I'm going to give it a 10 out of 10. OD. If y'all not into, onto Baki, you need to be. It's fucking, it's one of the best battle anime ever. And mangas. The art style is ridiculous. Kido Senshi Gundam. Senko no Hathaway. I, I don't know what that, oh, it's a movie. By Sunrise. Sunrise. Pretty Boy Detective Club. Wait a minute, you mean to tell me they have, they have something called Pretty Boy with no soldier boy? Nope. Cancelled because they're not gonna have no swag. What is spring on? The story centers on you Omi Nai, a high school student who is also a Sprigon, an agent charged by the Arkham Corporation to protect the ancient relics of an advanced older civilization from failing or falling, excuse me, into the hands of states and entities who wish to misuse them. Hmm. It comes from the manga Striker. Seems interesting. I'll at least give it my set as planning it's old head sauce oh, okay hey look I, I appreciate me some old head sauce all right i respect it at least if i don't you know completely fuck with it i'm not like my one brother not not little ooch little ooch he at least listens when i tell him to watch something brother ooch if it looks a certain way 
he will not give it any kind of time. Oh, I know Bang Dream. Bang Dream's a music game. And it's getting them fucking movie? Jesus. Holy shit. A uh, Bang Dream fucking... What the hell? They Two movies? Jeez, it must, it must be really popular in Japan then. Oh, uh, uh huh? Three? I'm... Th this is ridiculous. Three Bang Dream movies in one fucking year. Wow. Yo, Macross is getting a film? This is an action mecha music movie? There's a prequel. Okay, I need to I need to check this shit out then. Okay, I'm gonna add this to planning, but I need to actually check out the prequel shit because isn't that like a like a future funk genre of music or some shit? That's where all that shit comes from, maybe, if I'm getting this right. Is that am I am I not no? Is there's like a future funk artist that calls himself Macross? Oh, see, I thought they would. I thought they had something to do with each other. Never mind. What? Yo, they're making a um, Prince of Tennis movie. <gasps> Fire! Oh, I'll put this on my list. Oh my Nighthead 2041. What the fuck is this? Macross 89 blew up with blew up with the hit Young Bay. Yeah, I used to listen. I went right before DMCA was a thing. I used to listen to the Future Funk on the, on my stream all the time. Pacific Rim is getting a fucking anime. That's crazy. Damn, there's a lot of anime playing this year. Man, where the fuck is God of High School? That better come back. A by Wushang three. What the hell is Wushang 1 and 2? Oh, that makes me think, yo, that Wukong game. That's what I'm saying. It's an action fantasy. The third season of Hey Bai Wushang. What the fuck, man? It's Chinese. Oh, there's a lot of, uh, there's a lot more anime that, that they have on here than I expected to see for 2021. There's a lot of Chinese shit, too. All right, I think I reached the, the end finally. Okay, that's it. Yeah, there look, doesn't look... It looks like they're not bringing back God of High School. Well, maybe at the time. At, currently, they don't... They're not re announcing it, but... It's it's that and it's Tower of God that I'm not seeing on here for 2021. But it might get announced later on this year, so we'll see. I guess I hope that answered your question. You guys got to literally see me go through a list of all the 2021 anime... And I basically picked out the things that looked interesting enough or mentioned it or straight up added it to my planning list. Definitely use any list. It's a pretty good uh, resource to to like navigate through shit that's coming up to see a schedule and to also and to also like put, you know, what you're watching, what you what you're rewatching, what you've completed, what you have paused, dropped. See, like, my pause. Look look how much shit I have paused. I never finished Keijo, Hanebado, Tiger Mask. Holy shit. I never I finished Yu Yu Hakusho. I feel like out of all of my paused anime, I think Yu Yu Hakusho would take precedence over everything. Because I because I never finished it. Is Dragon Ball Super Season 2 potentially coming this year? Uh, Potentially. They haven't announced it yet, but it's presumed that it will. But the only thing that they have announced right now is reruns in japan that's it i my guess my guess is that if it comes back it's gonna come back when digimon is finished digimon currently is in the time slot that dragon ball would be in and it is supposed to have 66 episodes in total which means it'll run through this season and because right now this is considered the spring season i think it'll most likely come through starting this summer if if we're lucky because it, it, it it's been a it, it's been it's been far too long yeah i need i know i need to finish you <laughs> fist of the north star uh that's what i was thinking if i was if i didn't see you you right here i would have said fist of the north star in a heartbeat yo because look i got to fit episode 53 i have the blu-ray of the whole complete the whole complete season. Look at this. I never finished Digimon Tamers. I never finished Ahiro no Sora. I never finished Inuyasha. Kenshin. Yo. Too much. I j these are the only three that I've ever dropped. Assassin's Pride, Knights of Knights and Magic, and Angels of Fucking Death. And all of these were literally recommendations off Brother Ush. <laughs> so that was a nice little uh, intermission. Looking at animes. And all that. Let's keep playing this anime ass music.